going on everybody welcome back welcome back welcome back to the channel this is your boy t mcneil and this is indeed the dc show so if this is your first time in make sure that you guys like comment and subscribe as it says right on your screen i would definitely appreciate that to all of my non-subscribers out there if you guys are looking for the latest information and in sneaker news reviews updates and the newly acquired sneaker box we're talking about copper sneakers out here right here right here in your face guys for 100 or less Trust me, y'all, this is the place to be. And to all of my subscribers out there, as I always say, I thank you guys for tuning in every single day, watching all my content. All your comments, support, and feedback has definitely been appreciated. And uh, we're going to keep this thing moving together. All right? So, what's up with y'all today, man? I am back today with another video. And this time, we're going to talk about some Nike Reacts. Uh, basically, they're women edition shoes. So, I want to get you guys' thoughts and opinions on that. Um, we're going to talk about the $100 or less category. It's been quite a while since I've actually made content on this particular category. Um, and there's obvious reasons why. But the primary reason why is because the Nike outlets in my particular area where I live at is not really the best. Okay, just to give you guys an idea. Um, they don't have the best selection, okay, or the best variety of sneakers to really choose from. So that's the reason why I haven't really made um, too much videos on this particular segment trust me guys i want to fill this segment up a little bit more but again what i may have end up doing is probably going out a little bit further and um, checking out some additional nike retailers and because every nike retailer um in the outlets is different they all have a uh, variety of different inventories sometimes you find newly released jordans okay as well in those nike outlets but again it depends on the location and what the inventory looks like okay so that's probably going to be the remedy to the issue but um just stay tuned to keep it locked all right so what i got for you guys today obviously guys, i gotta look at the box one more time because it's kind of a long title this is the women's nike legend react twos is what these are called right here guys and the colorway all right they're calling this one more time guys is black gray and psychic pink all right guys psychic pink all right definitely feeling that man so let me know how you guys feel about this particular shoe and obviously they were caught for less than 100 dollars. so as i stated before guys this is one of those situations where you know like i tell you guys all the time you don't have to spend an arm and a leg to acquire great shoes okay and obviously this is a uh, workout shoe this could be a running shoe uh, exercise shoe etc basketball shoe you know whatever you want to do with this particular sneaker you can actually do it okay guys now given the fact that it is a low top sneaker um, you got a lower center of gravity with this sneaker so I'm not too upset with that even though the fact that I don't really care for the low top sneakers is, is you know it's usually a deal breaker for me but again uh, given the fact of what you're getting uh, these will be definitely an exception. All right. So, without further ado, man, let's go around these sneakers real quick. And uh, wow, power went off for a second. That's different. Hope you guys are still there with me. So, let's go over these joints, man. So, we they got the Nike React cushioning. Okay. One thing about they not only just the name being Nike React, but again having Nike React cushioning. Um, this is something that's definitely. Uh, a trademark of Nike okay this this cushion is very very soft to the touch and you're gonna get the best performance out of this guy so it's not only just gonna be a thing where it's gonna be the look and the style but you're going to get the comfort as well okay so I'm definitely excited about that but you guys can see it right there for yourself it does have Nike react and uh, we go over the shoes man give you guys an idea of what you're getting Yes, sir. Very, very nice, beautiful shoe. And uh, right before we actually get started, let's show them. Yes sir, yes sir, yes sir. So let's go over these joints, man. So like I said, you got the Nike Rack cushioning right there, guys. You have the solid rubber outsole, okay? Um, you got a beautiful 
uh, psychic pink Nike swoosh right there, guys. Kind of has like a reflective look to it right there, so I'm definitely feeling that. Um, you do have the breathable netted mesh material. Um, I've always been a fan of breathable netted mesh material because obviously it allows your feet to breathe, okay? That's what it does. And um, it's basically gonna let your feet get a lot of the moisture and things away from it, so your feet is not gonna sweat as much. And of course, when you have a, a jogging, exercise, running shoe, all of this is in the same category. You don't want the sweat to build up on your socks, on your feet, and then all of a sudden you're getting foul odors and things like that. So I'm definitely glad that Nike has, has thought this out with these particular shoes. And this is not the only sneaker that uh, Nike has in that React category for women, okay? It's a lot of different ones, but I like the colorway on this. I like the style of this as well, okay? Now you do have a rubberized strip, guys, also that's a part of the body of the shoe. It runs along the side of the shoe, guys, on the front where the toe box area is, and then it goes all the way around to the inner portion as well, okay? So that, that's a nice little touch from Nike. But kind of going back to the Nike swoosh real quick, again, it has that psychic pink colorway, but it also has a little bit of green in there as well. It almost has like a, a chameleon effect to it. So depending on how light or the sun or wherever you are hits that particular part of the shoe, you're gonna get a different result, especially when it comes to the colorway. So I'm definitely a big fan of that. Um, I do like the shoestrings. I mean, it, it's standard shoestrings. I mean, you do have a little bit of the uh, reflective material in this as well. Um, hopefully you guys will be able to see that. But it definitely does work, okay? Again, toe box area is very soft to the touch, guys. Very soft, breathable, um, netted mesh material, guys. And the material does stretch, so that's a good look. Um, that same material also applies onto the tongue of the shoe itself as well, guys. So let me know what you guys think about that. So you're getting not only that maximized comfort and support from the toe box area, but you're getting all the way up to your ankle as well. So I ain't too upset with that at all. Um, you do have a Nike swoosh on the uh, front ankle tab. I'm sorry, not an ankle tab, but the front tongue tab of the shoe. And you also have Legend React on the back heel base of the shoe on the ankle tab itself so i'm definitely feeling that okay guys now uh we go over the interior portion of the shoe i uh, hope you guys will be able to see that in the light but you do have nike react again not only just being the name of the shoe but also the type of material that was used in construction of this particular shoe preferably talking about the uh midsole of the shoe and the outsole as well okay so that nike react cushioning um, it's very good because it absorbs a lot of the shock, okay, guys, uh, on your feet and from your feet as well. So every time you take a step or every time that, you know, you're running or whatever you're doing, basically as your, as your feet, while you're wearing the shoes, hits that pavement, guys, that Nike React cushioning is going to kick in, okay? And basically it's going to, uh, again, absorb the shock from your body, your ankles and everything like that, your legs, and it's going to push that basically push that uh, absorption back up through your feet. Okay, guys, so the shoes are gonna basically, you know, up, you know what I'm trying to say, guys. It's, it's pretty much going to absorb all of the shock for you, okay, guys? So you don't have to worry about your feet hurting or uh, your toes hurting or your, your heels hurting or anything like that, okay? So just kind of breaking it down how the Nike React cushioning works. Um, I'm not a scientist, you know, I'm not anything like that. But just based off what I've read and some of the research that I've done on this particular shoe and just Nike React cushioning period, uh, this is what they came up with. Okay, so again, the cushioning is going to be there, it's absorbent, and that's the whole purpose on this particular sneaker. Okay, y'all. And last but not least, man, let's talk about um, the outsole of the very bottom of the shoe. Uh, this is also one of my favorite portions of this particular sneaker. I like the big giant Nike swoosh guys that's been engraved in the bottom of the shoe. And obviously if you guys can see there, it does come on both sides, depending on which way that you're looking at it on the camera. But I like the black and white colorway guys. I like the um, socket pink, that's what they're calling that. And again, you have a lot of the grip at the very bottom of these sneakers as well. So this, this is a really good shoe, you know, especially, I won't say for like mountain climbing or anything like that, but it's just gonna give you that, that extra cushioning, it's gonna give you that extra impact, okay? And on top of that, it's giving you the extra grip so you're not slipping and sliding around 
uh, depending on your environment and where you decide to actually uh, work out in or wear these particular sneakers. All right, y'all. So that's pretty much it, man. Of the gotta say it one more time, guys. The women's Nike Legend React Twos. If you guys have any comments or questions, man. Uh, leave us down below, brother. We'll definitely get back to you. Um, this is probably not going to be a sought after shoe for most people. Trust me, I do understand that. It's not going to be a sneaker that uh, a lot of you guys are probably going to be feeling like that. Uh, this is exclusively for the ladies. Uh, this is something that uh, not only looks good on their feet, but at the end of the day, like I said, it's going to not only be comfortable, it's going to be stylish, but at the same time, you know, it's going to give you uh, maximized support, especially for your heel and your toe area again with this absorbent Nike React cushion. All right. So any comments, questions, man, leave it down below, brother. Get back to you. Also, if you have not done so already, make sure that you guys tap the bell symbol. That way, you receive notification as soon as I put up new content for the channel. You guys being on it, and then that way you won't miss nothing. All right. So I do appreciate you guys watching and listening and tuning in. Until the next time, make sure that you guys have a good one and you stay safe. Deuces.